Today, I'm gonna remaster my bow guide. I made one four months ago, but um, a lot of people want an updated version because I'm assuming they think it's outdated. So, um, here it is. I'm gonna make a new bow guide. Yay! All right, let's get into the video. Let's start simple, and the very first thing you need to do is to simply practice your aim. I mean, how are you gonna be good of a range weapon if you can't aim? <laughs> Just, you know, practice like on non-moving targets, moving targets, just on anyone. And along with practicing your aim, right, let me sit my back because this also fits in. Get in a comfortable sitting position because if you're sitting comfortably, that means you can move your arm easier and you also, you can aim easier. Here. Right, let me grab my camera. Uh, I, know, I use one of these for wrist support and I can aim very comfortably doing this like I have a lot of room to work with I'm sitting straight up back up arm straight you want a nice comfortable sitting position that helps your aim a lot and speaking of the mouse um don't grip it too tightly because if you grip it too tightly you're gonna just have trouble controlling your arm like like letting go like when it comes to charging your bow like holding down and letting go if you have a like a looser grip on your mouse it's easier to do that like your muscles don't like cramp up as much so it's easier to control your arm in general and your hands and your fingers just have a lighter grip on your mouse and this is just from experience from playing the game but just learn how your enemy moves I mean your arrow has a trajectory so you know it travels like you know with time it does, it's not a hit scan game you gotta shoot where they're going you can't just shoot at them are they walking over shoot you know in front of them so they're like walking and then you shoot this way so they walk into it. I'm looking at my other monitor so I can see if I'm doing this example good. But yeah, um, practice your arrow trajectory. If you're using a range weapon, <laughs> use a range weapon, keep your distance. You get, keep, Try to keep a reasonable distance away from your enemy. If you want to get close to someone, still try to stay out of melee range if possible. If you have to get close and personal, use your fists. You know, they're, they're use your, your, your punchers, your um, your abusers. Uh, I mean, what? <laughs> abusers! Use your fucking abusers! Um, but yeah, um, your fists are a very good way to um, get people off of you. Just start, like, slapping them, start punching them, and start, like, you know, killing them. And eventually they'll fuck off. Just, like, avoid, like, any other weapon in the game will avoid getting hit. Avoid getting hit by a weapon. Don't take damage, but punch back and win with your fists and spacing. Roll around, roll, slide, keep your distance, use your bow, shoot and head, win. Very simple um, step. Use your parry, learn how to parry, you know. I don't really need to go into this very much, but as a ranged person, you need to learn how to parry because it's very effective of getting people off your ass. If punching won't work, guess what will work? Parry, because they're swinging at you. Block them shit, headshot, kill, win. Remember your bow reload time. Like, you know, like when you shoot an arrow and have to reload it. If you remember it good, you can just spam arrows really fast and be really annoying. <laughs> it pisses off crossbow users, trust me. Remember to stand still for a millisecond when you shoot. If you're moving at all, your accuracy would be decreased by a lot. So stand still when you shoot. If you're bad at landing headshots, aim for the upper chest, because you're most likely going to get a lucky headshot sometimes. So practice with that. If you want to be sweaty, bring kunai, so you can headshot kunai someone a bow, because that's a very fast kill. You could jump shot with range weapons, you have to, while you're, when you jump in the air, you hold crouch and release the shoot button. That's how you jump shot with a range weapon. Well, that's um, my bow guide, my updated one. Hopefully I don't need to update this again, I mean, <laughs> I, th I think four months is a pretty short lifespan for a bow guide, and I hope this one lasts a little longer than that, you know? But, um, thank you for watching, and have a good day.